Hi everybody, I'm Rockin' Robin, and today's episode I am making spicy lentil soup. This is a great dish for this time of year in the fall, and it's hearty, it's vegetarian and gluten-free, and delicious, and it's easy to make. So let's go over our ingredients so we can get started with our soup. We are gonna need some olive oil, some red lentils, some coconut milk. Here I have some finely diced yellow onion. We'll need a little butter, finely diced garlic, some chopped and de-seeded tomatoes, a little bit of cayenne pepper, garam masala, some turmeric, some fresh cilantro. This is vegetable broth. We'll need some fresh ginger root and some salt and pepper. So before we get started, I wanna show you real quick how to de-seed a tomato. So basically take your tomato and cut it in half and then take out the little core there, just make a little V cut. And then cut each half in half so you've got quarters like this. And go ahead and grab yourself a paring knife. And what you're gonna do is you're just gonna run your knife right underneath the seeds. and it, they just pop right out, just like that. And that's all you have to do. And then from that point, all you have to do is just make little slices, turn it the other direction, and you've got a nice little finely diced tomato. Now I wanna show you the best way or the easiest way to peel your ginger root to get it ready. We wanna mince this up. So I'm just gonna cut a little tip off and you wanna take like a spoon, the back of a spoon, and you just use it to peel down the skin and it just comes right off. Real nice and easy, just like that. Now that we've got the skin off of the ginger root, we'll just chop up our piece and then we're just gonna do some thin slices. And then we'll just cut it in the other direction. And we're gonna chop this until it's finely diced. So the first thing we wanna do is I have a nice, good sized pot here. In fact, it's plenty big. And I've got the temperature on. We're gonna start with medium low, get it hot. And then I'm gonna add a couple of tablespoons of olive oil. You can see it's already shimmering in there. And the butter. Once that butter melts, I'm gonna add my onions to this. Right. And we're gonna saute our onions for about six to eight minutes, something like that. And I'm gonna go ahead and add just a little bit of salt to this. And we'll just keep stirring it until they get nice and soft. So you can see here that the onions have softened up. So now it's time we're gonna add our garlic. We'll add the ginger. The garam masala. The turmeric. and just a little bit of cayenne pepper. Now you can leave that out if you don't want it too spicy. And now we're just gonna stir this for just a few seconds, get it all combined, and then we're gonna add some more ingredients. Now my temperature is on medium low. All right, so now we're gonna add our vegetable broth. Next, we'll do our coconut milk. This is gonna make it nice and rich and creamy. And the lentils. Now we wanna stir that up to combine everything. I'm gonna turn the temperature up to high. We wanna bring this to a boil. Once it comes to a boil, you wanna watch it so that it doesn't boil over because of the coconut milk. Then we're gonna turn it down, we're gonna partially cover it, 
and we're going to simmer it for about 20 to 30 minutes. All right, so here's our soup at a nice full boil. So I'm going to turn it down to simmer. I'm going to put it to low and I'm going to leave it partially covered. Check back with this in 20 minutes. We'll see how it's going and maybe we'll go 30. We'll just see how quickly those lentils cook. The soup is done. I just pulled it off the stove. Whew, you can see that whole plume of smoke, I mean steam come up. And I want you to have a look at this. It looks nice and creamy. It gets very, very creamy and smooth as it cooks. And I'm going to add a little bit of salt to this. I've tasted it once. It needs a little bit more and a little bit of pepper. Give that a stir. And now we're going to add the cilantro. Toss that in. And now we're ready to serve it up. It smells amazing. I love all those spices that are in there. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and serve it up and then we're gonna top it off with a little bit of tomatoes. Look at that. It's nice and thick. It's a very hearty soup. And that should do it. And then we'll just take a little bit of our tomato and sprinkle it right on top. Doesn't that look beautiful? All right, so now if I can Cool it off a bit. I'm going to take a taste. Tomato in there. Mm. Mm. Those flavors are really, really delicious. Hearty soup, great time of year to make this. Guys, I hope you'll give this a try. And thanks for watching and spending time with me today. And be sure and subscribe to my channel. Share the recipe if you like it and leave me a comment. Thanks for watching.